It's more than 20,000 feet above the ground here, and Amelia is struggling to make her way to the top of the balloon. It's very dangerous, but she has no choice. She must climb to the top of the balloon to release the gas, so that the balloon can descend, or she will freeze to death at this altitude. At the moment the ropes are all frozen, she climbs with difficulty and her hands are growing frostbite. Looking up, it is quite a distance from the top of the balloon. She wants to grab the rope beside her, so she struggles to reach her hand over. Suddenly, she almost falls, and her whole body hangs upside down from the balloon. She feels so tired, and the cold and lack of oxygen make her gradually lose consciousness. She recalls her husband. A few years ago, to save her, her husband fell from the basket. She immediately wakes up, then she tries again and successfully reaches the rope. She ties the rope to herself and continues to climb upward, and she finally makes it to the top of the balloon. She must hurry, she hits the gas valve with her hand and tries to open it. But it doesn't work, the valve is frozen. Then she slowly stands up and kicks it as hard as she can. The valve is finally opened, and she shoves her boot into the valve, allowing the gas to release slowly. After doing all this, she can't hold on any longer and passes out again. As expected, the balloon finally stops rising and begins to go down. The problem is, that the release of gas changes the curve of the top of the balloon, which makes the unconscious Amelia slowly slides down. She falls down. She wakes up and finds that she is still alive, and it is the rope she tied to her body that saved her life. She calls out to her partner James in the basket, but James has long been unconscious. She can't just keep hanging here, she must find a way to get back to the basket. She holds on to the rope and tries to swing back to the basket. After a few attempts, she finally reaches the edge of the basket and climbs in. The story begins two years ago. Amelia and her husband were both passionate aeronauts. But during a flight with her husband, the balloon malfunctioned and then descended rapidly. To slow the descent, they threw out everything they had, but it didn't make much of a difference. In the end, her husband chose to jump off the basket to reduce the weight, leaving the chance of survival to Amelia. For two years, she has been living with guilt, she blames herself for her husband's death. Until this day, her sister comes to her and forcibly takes her to a social event. At the party, Amelia befriends James. James is an ambitious scientist, but his weather theories have been ridiculed by his peers. Therefore, he always wants to take a balloon to high altitudes to conduct research and collect data, which is the only way to prove his theories right. After some discussion, Amelia finally agrees to partner with James for a balloon adventure. In fact, she wants to beat the highest world record of 23,000 feet, because it was her husband's last wish. After successfully raising the funds, they then start to make the balloon. On a sunny morning, they perform a big launch ceremony. Amelia even brings a dog with her, but after the balloon rises to a certain altitude she suddenly throws the dog out, and people are terrified. Before hitting the ground, the dog's parachute is opened, and it lands safely. At the moment Amelia and James are already 1,000 feet from the ground, they continue to ascend, and Amelia changes into her specialized clothes. After a while, the balloon flies into the clouds. The clouds are so thick that they can't see anything around them, it's cumulonimbus clouds. Soon it starts to rain, followed by lightning and thunder. Apparently, a storm is coming, they must escape immediately. The balloon lost its balance in the storm as if it would be overturned at any time. Amelia is suddenly blown away by the wind, but fortunately, she grabs the rope and is pulled back by James. She is an experienced aeronaut, and she knows that the best thing to do in a situation like this is to ascend, they need to ascend above the cumulonimbus clouds. Amelia and James throw the sandbags down to reduce the weight. The balloon rises quickly, they hold on to the basket to avoid being blown away by the strong wind. After a while, the rain stops, and they finally see the sunlight as the balloon flies out of the clouds. They are amazed by the scenery, it is a beauty they have never seen before. Then they discover a large group of butterflies. It turns out that insects can really travel on air currents, this is a great scientific discovery. James records the data and passes it to the ground by pigeons in case they don't survive. Soon they reach the altitude of 23,000 feet. Since they have beaten the highest record, Amelia wants to go down immediately. But James insists on continuing to go up, he wants to continue his scientific exploration. He convinces Amelia, but soon he starts experiencing hypoxia and he goes a little crazy. He frantically reduces the weight of the basket, for science James is willing to give up his life. Amelia slaps him in the face and wakes him up. They have now reached a very dangerous altitude, they must go down immediately, but then the gas valve is stuck. If they can't release the gas, the balloon will continue to go up, and they will soon die due to the cold and lack of oxygen. James has passed out, and Amelia decides to climb to the top of the balloon to open the valve. Although it is very dangerous, she manages to do it. Amelia slides down, grabs the rope, and swings back to the basket, waiting with James for the balloon to descend. But soon they run into a new problem. 
Amelia's boot got stuck in the valve and the valve wouldn't close, which caused the balloon to go down faster and faster. After several attempts, Amelia finally pulls down her boot and closes the valve, but it is too late. The balloon is going down like crazy, they throw all the things in the basket but still can't slow it down. James comes up with a solution, they climb to the framework, and then abandon the basket, since the basket is the heaviest object. The descending speed does slow down a bit, but it is still not enough. And the balloon is running out of gas, with a descending speed like this, they will surely die. Amelia wants to sacrifice herself as his husband did and leave the opportunity to James, but James stops her. James cut a few ropes again and simply releases all the gas. Without gas, the balloon quickly forms the shape of a parachute, which slowly descends. They fall into the woods and are slightly injured, but luckily they both survive. This is a movie based on a true story. James' findings prove the existence of layers in the atmosphere, paving the way for the first weather forecasts. I am Movie Ape, thanks for watching.